Welcome back to Dyson Sphere Program, folks. We have Titanium Alloy, which is awesome because we need that for these guys. We also need this, which we can make. And we just unlocked Casimir Crystals Research. So that is all good. So yeah. If we grab a couple a hundred of those. How much titanium is left in here? Some, some. Okay. And then we head to our bus. is somewhere not sure where though <laughs> there it is uh, okay so we want to make two of these for that we need to make Two of these. Oh, we need titanium. Let's go grab some of that titanium before it uses it all. Don't use all the titanium! Don't use it all. I'll grab all of that. Whew! Okay, now, we also need those, so, we need some circuit boards, we already had some, uh, what else do we need? These guys, which is silicon, and uh, so we need a bit of high purity silicon, which we have here. We need some uh, some of you. We can now make one of these. We need some steel. The steel we have down here. Uh, not that much, probably. Uh, we can make another one. We can make one of those! So all we need now is some more of this. Uh, we need... I think we need some... Uh, uh, where are they? They are here. We only have ten of them on us, right? Yeah. We have one, we have one. Uh -huh. uh, wait, cancel that. Let's just wait and see here. Let's land. No point in flying around like that. So we need to make 
ten of these as well. We can make seven. Okay. Let's just give that a second. I'll be right back when uh, when this is done. Right. So while we were making our two uh, planetary logistics things, uh, planetary logistics stations, I decided to just quickly set up a production line of the microprocessors or microcrystalline components and the processors because we're going to need a lot of them. So I quickly set that up. And we already have 64 of them. Very nice, very nice. Uh, we have some of those. All right, so in order to make these, we can, in fact, produce two of these now. Wonderful. Then we need to produce, in reality, 20 of these, but 10 is good enough for now. Uh, let's produce another six. Uh, no, let's wait and get these guys. You know what? We'll wait until we have some more of these because now we can produce ten of these. Just have to produce the thrusters first. Uh, we'll wait a little bit longer for some more of these. But it's time. It is time to head over to our titanium planet. Let's grab some of those. Let's see. Whoops. With what we are making now, we we'll have a logistics station. We'll have ten of those, and that's good enough. So, let's fly over there, uh, if we can find it. There it is. I go to Bootus 4, I hope that's the one. It is, right? Uh, oops. Why am I not speak speeding up? Something is wrong. There we go. Alright, I'll be right back when we arrive. Okay, we are almost there. Almost there. Let's slow down a bit. And we have arrived. Where is our base? Over there. There we have it. And how are we looking for power? We, we're gonna need a lot more power, so I think I'll just set up a bunch of wind turbines and then I'll be back. 
Right. So, an extra 100 uh, wind turbines have been set up. And we are now generating 33.5 megawatts. It's not great, but it's better. And we have this big beauty. This big beauty. Which we will plant right there. With some power. Look you at that. You have established an interstellar logistics station and open the first node of logistics transportation among the planets. With it, no need to transport cargo between planets manually anymore. Just set to remote supply in the site on the raw material supply planet. The logistics vessel will bring the cargo to the other planets with corresponding remote demand sites accordingly. Setting local supply and demand can also inherit the functions of ordinary logistics station at the same time. Okay. So we will say titanium remote supply. We will say fire ice remote supply, and we will say uh, let's leave it at that for now because I'm not sure I want. Now yeah, we we can actually set it up because we will be doing silicon as well. Where is high purity silicon? There. All right, and we have our ten ships, which we will stick in here, and now they are parked on top here. Isn't it cool? It looks so cool, man. I love it. And it's charging up slowly but it is and now all we need is actually I don't think I want this here anymore so we'll remove those two and dismantle drop back to there And we'll get this running in. So we have the silicon there, and we have the... Uh, sure. That's fine. And we can empty out these. So there we go. Wonderful. The same will be happening to this guy. Uh, actually, we'll run it over this way. She might as well come in there. How much do we have in here now? 600? 700? Okay. And the same will happen to this guy here. So we will... Merge these. directly into there and this directly into there and come into the 
splitter here. And then come over here. Why? There. Okay. So all three are filling up. Very nice. We have some inventory space so we can grab some and bring back. We do. So let's just grab some of those. And some of those. And bring back with us. And I will fly back home and get. The next one going. The next station. Uh, so I'll be right back. All right, we are back home, and we need titanium here, and we need uh, fire ice over here. So this would be a perfect spot to build a little. Well, I say little, it's not little. A little one of these. And we will give it some power. With curse. There we go. And we can get 10 more on this. And I want to do that. Uh, so before we set it up, because we want to see them take off and stuff, right? Uh, so where is my bus? There. Uh, let's just fill up on some fuel. And let's see if we have what we need. Uh, let's stick you in there. We have 146 of them. Uh, components, these, we can make six. What are we missing? We're missing the titanium alloy. Okay. Uh, this is the wrong way, isn't it? I could never find it. Uh, it's over here. Okay, titanium alloy. Where the heck is it? It's up there. We're almost there. I'm just impatient. All right, let's grab some titanium alloy. Can we make four more now? No, we can make two. Oh, we're missing those. Okay. Well, that we can get. Let's head back here. And find these guys. Can we make four more? We can. Outstanding. 
Alrighty. And actually, I will drop off all of this titanium alloy up here. Uh, or not the titanium alloy, the titanium. We'll drop off here. Very good. And then I just need to find where... This thing is... So need to head over here. Where is it? Where is it? The massive tower. There it is. Next to its little brother. Okay. So, we will stick our ten interstellar freighters in here. And I'll close that. And stand here. So that we can see that when we say titanium ingot, remote demand, these guys will start taking off. Isn't it cool? I think it's so cool. And they'll be taking off over on the other uh, planet as well. And fire ice, uh, remote demand. So it'll start by doing uh, the titanium, I guess. Let's stick you in there. Now all we need to do is set up a line. So, let's do it. And we want titanium. I'll come over here. Come down here, come up and over. back. It's a bit weird, a bit wonky. Uh, it would actually be smarter to do this. Go. Oh, here comes some ships, and here comes the titanium. Isn't it wonderful? And these ones are the ones from the other, um, from the other, uh, let's head out here. from the other station. So we have a bunch on the way there and we have a bunch on the way back. I love it, man. I think it's so cool. I really, really do. I really, really do. Uh, okay. So that's that hooked up. Let's do... I actually do want a chest full of it. So, let's stick a storage in here. Alright. 
Still has more than a thousand. And oh. and these are going again because of the titanium now arriving, which means we'll start researching again, which is fan freaking tastic. Yes, we are researching. Now, the uh, fire ice, let's get that going as well. And we'll select fire ice. Uh, and do that. Oh, here comes one. Here they come. Here they all come. And these are the ones from this uh, tower. So you can see they land on top on their spots here and deliver. Man. <laughs> I love it. All right. Uh, let's set up a storage for fire ice as well. Just for good measure. And if we take a look here, we have 2,000 uh, titanium in transit. We have 2,000 fire ice in transit. Beautiful. And we can actually set this to local supply this as well if we can build some drones can we build some drones we can let's build 10 Look at the drones going. Isn't it cool? I think it's very, very cool. Uh, do we have some drones yet? No, not yet. No, I don't suppose we can build one of these. No. But all we need is titanium, really. So if we just grab that, then we can produce one of those. Here comes the fire ice. And some titanium. That one of them was mixed, it looked like. Cool. Alright, so that means that we'll be getting more of that stuff. And we now have some drones. So let's grab Let's say five of them and stick in here. And then we can go. Uh, where is that? It's way over here on the other side of the planet, basically. It might be easier to go this way, actually. We're researching. It's not super fast, but we are researching. So, are we arriving at this spot? Uh, where the heck are we? Where is it?
It's should be around here somewhere. That's all the science. So it's down there. We're over here. There we go. We need to do something about all that hydrogen that is being stored up as well. Now, over here. I would like to set up a tower. Let's have it right there. Bam! We will give it some power. And we will say titanium demand. So there's 125 titanium on the way. And we'll filter to titanium. And there we go. Let's stick the other five in here. The first five are already here. Lovely. And then we can actually set this to supply. Uh, where are they? There. Supply. And we can send this in there. There we go. Now we will start storing those up. Wow, the titanium has already gone. That 125 titanium did not last long. comes another 250 and there we go might actually need more drones for this but this is fine for now we are producing the things and getting transportation automatically, which is wonderful. And it's also wonderful that these drones can tell me which way to fly. <laughs> so we have a thousand, twelve hundred titanium on the, on the way, 1200 fire ice. about just going back and forth back and forth it's wonderful we have tons of titanium is this storage actually full it is actually full I'm 
Nice. So this is going flat out. This is going flat out. Making the titanium crystals. And we're actually keeping up more or less with these guys. Yeah, more or less, almost. Almost keeping up. Are you going to start spitting out? Oh, almost. Oh, it's very, very tight. There, it spat out a little bit. So if we want to expand this, we need to expand this. Research complete! Miniature particle collider. Very nice. We do have room to increase the production a little bit here. to increase the production a little bit. All the hydrogen is going to make no fuel. A lot of them are saying. Why are they saying no fuel? Ah, because they were... Uh, it was backed up because this is full. But we are using it now. I think they'll start getting their fuel. Man, nothing, none of it is going that way. So that whole line is not getting fuel. But we are researching, well we're not, because we haven't selected a research. Uh, I want that, I want that, I want that, uh, I want veins utilization, I actually want that before those two. Um, logistics carrier engine. Why can't I research that? <laughs> Weird. Oh, because I haven't researched the first one. Duh. Queue you up. Queue you up. Uh, we can't do range utilization three. We can do research speed. No. Logistics carrier capacity, sorter cargo stacking. Uh, queue that up. Okay, our queue is full. Solar sail life. Okay. Oh, we can even go up here. Uh, not there. This we've already done. We can even do this one. More speed. Nice. We can do that. We can do that. Very nice. We can't do these. It requires Mechacore level 4. Huh. 
these we can. We can do this. And this. No, not that. But we can even do this. Get some even more speed. Very cool. Alright. Let's see how much our yellow research is doing. It's actually doing quite a lot. It's actually doing quite a lot. But of course it would be nice to have it going at full tilt. And the same with the reds. But we are sciencing at a decent pace. So that's kind of nice. That is kind of nice. And yeah, we definitely need more diamonds, right? Or titanium crystals. Most decidedly. Decidedly. There's no doubt about that. Well, oh, here comes some fire ice. Titanium ingots, fire ice, titanium ingots, titanium ingots, fire ice. It's so cool, I love it. I can just sit here and watch this. <laughs> but of course, that's not very entertaining. But we are out of time anyway. I just wanted to take a second to to check it out and see how we were doing. Uh, let's actually uh, take a look at research. 286.5 hash a second. Hmm. It's not super fast, but it's going. It's going. Wow. We need a lot more power. We need a lot more power. Jesus. Okay, well, we'll have to fix that. It's for, because of the hydrogen. Our hydrogen guys are dead. Uh, but. I think we can fix that. Uh, then there is... Uh, I wanted to check out production of... Uh, of our cubes. So we're producing... around 70 a minute. So it's a little over one per second. Of the yellows. So that's pretty good. But we want more. We want more. Let's put all the science on one. So that we can just do that. Okay, but we, as I said, we are out of time, so we will have to continue in the next one. But I think we are in a very good place now that we have interstellar logistics and also planetary logistics. It will help a lot with the base and getting things going 
maybe a little bit faster. So yeah, it's, it's great. It's great. Now, how much titanium do we have in here? 1875. Oh, we have two, more than 2000 in storage and the same for the fire ice. And here's uh, arrived some. A little bit of both. Very cool. Very, very cool. So yeah, thank you very much for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.